hello everyone in this video i'm going to talk about wondershare uniconverter a really awesome tool that gives you access to a bunch of different ai tools and uh, compressors text to speech screen recorder image enhancer and video enhancer so uh, these tools are really useful today so uh, you can generate uh, let's say an ai video and you can use the video enhancer to upscale your videos very easily inside of this tool here Another good thing for like if you have an e-commerce or a website and you want to upload maybe some video, the compressor is really good because usually you do not need to have a really high quality video for your website. You can still maintain the quality, but you can decrease the size by using something like compressor. And I'll also show you some other things that can be used inside of these tools. But first of all, let's go into the video enhancer so that I can show you what we can do with this. So if you hover over your mouse, you'll see files and if we click on this one here we can choose one of the files that we want to enhance so I want to enhance one of my AI generated videos so I created this by generating an image from ChatGPT then I animated it by giving it to clean AI and now I want to enhance it and upscale it so inside here we have a few different options we have video enhancement and as you see if you have like a low quality or pixelated video, you can just enhance it and get a much clearer video out of it. The denoiser reduces noise and if you have like maybe captured some footage with your camera and you see that it has some noise, you can just reduce it by clicking on this feature here. And we have the frame interpolation, so you can just input your video here and it will create more frames in between your existing frames and it makes it much much smoother. And lastly we have the video upscaler so it upscales your video without losing any quality and you can go up to 8k with this one here. With that said this video already has a good quality so we can just use the upscaler here instead. And once you click on the video upscaler you have an option here so it's 2x you upscale it by two times or you can upscale it by four times. So for this one let's go with 4x. And then before you export, if you want to change the folder, you can just click on this one here and change it. All right, let's export. And once you click on export, you'll see the original on the left and you'll see the results here on the right. And it takes a bit of time to analyze the files, but it goes pretty quick. So I'll just pause the video and show you the results that we get. Another one is the compressor here, as I mentioned. So let's try this one out. Let's click on add files and I have prepared a stock footage for this one. So this is the footage here. And once we click it, you can see by how much you can compress it. So it's at 70% and it is originally 30 megabytes. Let's reduce it to 50% so we can have half the size. And if we click on format, we can change to a bunch of different formats here. I'll leave it at MP4 for now. And if we click on advanced settings, you can also control the resolution and frame rate and so on. So let's click on OK and just click on compress all. And there we go. So as you can see, there is barely any difference, but the size is half the original file. And one of the use cases for this can be for search engine optimization. If you have a website and you want to upload your videos, but you want to have a website that loads fast at the same time. So this is what you can do. You can compress it and then you can upload the video. Let's try one of my favorites here. So if we go to video, we can click on watermark remover. So this can remove watermarks from any videos or images and you can also give it a batch or a bunch of different videos and it will remove all of the watermarks for you without needing to repeat the same process over and over again. So let's click on add files and I'll just start with this one here. And we can just click here and select the area like this and you will get a border and if we click on play we can see if the logo goes outside of the borders. And 
over here we can choose the AI model so there is the basic and then there is the quality one so the basic one says suitable for small area watermark removal focusing on speed and the next one is for a larger area focusing on quality so let's go with the quality one for this one so we can just click on export so it takes a few seconds and here are the results So before moving on to the next one, I also want to mention the screen recorder. So if you ever wanted to like record a session, presentation, or maybe start your own YouTube channel, a screen recorder is a very important thing and uh, this is a really good one. And besides that, we also have the video editor. So you can just put in any video that you want. Let's put this one here and then we can just choose crop to crop it. You can choose the other features here. So you have the aspect ratio if you want to change it to something else and you can rotate, adjust the speed. So sometimes if you generate AI videos, you see that it feels a bit slow and this is how you can fix it by activating the speed and then increasing it by going downwards here and decrease by going upwards here. Pretty basic. And you can add your own watermark and fade in, fade out. And if you want to, like, let's say we play this one here, but we don't want maybe the ending. So we can just cut the ending by dragging this one here. So let's decrease it to four seconds. There we go and click OK. Now we have trimmed the video. And this is great because you do not need to put it inside a big editing software or anything like that and export it and wait for it to render or whatever. You can just click on export here and it's finished. There we go. All right, everyone. There are a lot of tools as I mentioned earlier, so make sure you check this out. There is also some other categories here. If you go to image and audio and video and then the hot ones are the ones that are used the most. So make sure you check them out and check the link in the description below and thank you for watching. Bye bye.